Our stand-up guest tonight came to Australia from Tokyo six years ago as an exchange student and fell in love with comedy. He's performing his show Japan Things at the Sydney Comedy Festival from May 10th to 13th. Please welcome Takashi Wakasugi. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, I just moved to Australia and uh, I love Australia and I love doing English comedy in Australia <laughs> because that was very tough doing English comedy in Japan. <laughs> Japanese people, they don't understand English. Well, they go to English comedy show to study English. <laughs> I saw one Japanese girl in the audience. She came to the show with dictionary. <laughs> it's crazy. I say joke, I say punchline in English, she check dictionary, and she say, oh, so funny. <laughs> so true. <laughs> that time, my joke was, I'm Japanese, which means my dick is small, <laughs> which means my sperm's so fresh. <laughs> you know, such a short journey, much fresher. Then she said, oh, so true, fuck off. <laughs> I don't care. I have a big balls. <laughs> anyway, uh, Japan is a nice country. Japan is a nice country, and uh, you might love it, but I'm Japanese, so I might say I'm tired of being Japanese. I'm fucking tired of being Japanese. <laughs> if you're Japanese, so many tiring things happen. For example, like Japanese people, we dress well, anytime, anywhere. <laughs> I went to uni in Japan, and the Japanese girls' university student go to class wearing high heels and perfect makeup. It's cute. <laughs> I also studied abroad in Australia as an exchange student, and I still remember first day in the first class, I entered the classroom, and I said, no, everybody pajamas. <laughs> I'm so Japanese. <laughs> and also, Japan is very clean. It's good, it's good. But I think Japanese people, we are too clean to enjoy life. <laughs> For example, I love watching movies. My favorite is The Lord of the Rings. It's such a nice movie. Adventure, friendship, brave. I love it. But every time I watch The Lord of the Rings, in my head, I scream, how smelly are they? <laughs> They didn't take shower for a long time. <laughs> didn't brush your teeth. <laughs> Fucking shampoo Gandalf. <laughs> I'm so Japanese. <laughs> and also, I'm tired of Japanese girls. They are nice, cute, polite, but negative sometimes. <laughs> I met one Japanese girl, so I try to make her happy. And then I try to say something good. Then I say, oh, you're beautiful like sunflower. You're beautiful like sunflower. Then she said, Fuck you. <laughs> and I said, why? And she said, my skin, it's not that bad. <laughs> Did you understand? I tried to mean you are beautiful, like sunflower and flower part. I never mean fucking seas in your face. <laughs> so Japanese. <laughs> and also, I'm tired of drinking, actually. Japan is the best place to drink. Alcohol is quite cheap and the safety, but I cannot drink a lot. It's very tiring. A few months ago in Japan, I was so drunk. I was so drunk and I slept. They wake up next morning, I try to wake up and I realize I pee in my bed. <laughs> I pee in my bed. The question is how do you wash your bed? It's too big for washing machine, but I had to wash because my pee was yellow. <laughs> oh, this is my bed, my pee? <laughs> Huge. <laughs> I know the pee was so fresh because of short journey, <laughs> but still dirty. I worry if my friend coming to my place, they ask me a question why your bed is yellow. It's not good, so I have to cover up by something. And I got idea. Tujuro Pikachu in my bed. <laughs> it's cute, but it's not Pikachu, it's Pikachu. <laughs> Smells bad. Thanks so much, that's my time. Pikachu Wakasugi, everybody! Jules it is! Jules, you got the